Okay, now we're nearing the end of this. Pardon me, I just had to clear up a little bit of storage. Because this read-through is a very long video. Okay, first your signature styles. So it would be Anderson, Anderson's a streetwear chick. With her backward bat, baseball cap, fire accents, red, t-shirt with a red sparkle logo, final bust, final, final bustier top, or, or bustier or whatever, flannel plaid skirt, shirt, sparkle gear, high-waisted skinny jeans, heel sandals, cure final straps, custom kicks. Basically, she's usually one of, she's one of those people who wears a bunch of, of Supreme merch. <laughs> For Pye Rowan. It's Hip Hop Fives. So her color is orange. And mar her seam is Monarch Butterflies. She has a final bustier top. Cropped puffer jacket. Slip dress with a sheer overlay. My favorite piece. Shut up, Laurel. Whatever. Knee high statement boots. DJ spec spectacles. Gold accents. So for Sunny Madison. It's quirky and unique. Her her skin color is yellow, and she, and she has like a lot of the sun and moon in her styling, because she's apparently inspired by like Sailor Moon or something. So she has a jersey a jersey style jacket, a pastel baby doll dress, golden eyeshadow, thigh high leg socks with a rainbow stripe cross top, platform sneakers, and Jade. Her hunter, her style is dramatic and baggy. Her and her scene color is green. Casual, and her and her scenes are casual and graffiti. So she has a beanie, a baggy t-shirt with, with its logo, puffer jacket, knee length starts with graffiti, green nails, and sneakers. And she says, and people, and after the cl show claims, she started the anti-sparkle thing, but I'm sorry. We had it on our Jeep way before she ever came to Rainbow High. So, yeah. Yes, our license plates say anti-sparkle, and they're amazing. And then there's Skylar. Her theme color is blue. And and she also has a denim and underdated style. So she has a denim bustier top. What is these people's obsession with, 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 with bustier tops? No offense. Um, V, aren't you wearing one? Um, yeah. But mine is, is more stylish. It goes with my with my tweed suit, so yeah, yours looks looks way better. Actually, I don't know what type of top my top is, but it's beautiful. And so she has a cropped short sleeve turtleneck, a denim jacket with chevron stripes, a clear vinyl belt, a denim mini skirt, denim dresses. Ankle socks, translucent pastel platform sneakers. Now for Violet. Oh yeah, and Skylar's is also considered all American. So, yeah, her style is very. is is very much deep from that. For Violet Willow, it's Lux Bling. So the amazing violet. It also has a lot of glamour and shimmer in it. So she has a shimmery faux fur jacket. 
an iridescent sequined ultra topped mini dress, shimmery ankle socks, purple jockey heel sandals with pearls, and of course, she always has her phone on her because she's an influencer. Those are her pages. And then there's Bella Ch Parker, who's Beverly Hills Chic. So her theme is pink. She also has pearls and bows. And yeah, she she's copying me with the bows. No offense. So she has a pink crop top. A two-piece tweed, tweed blazer and mini skirt set, which... I absolutely slay in, and I am wearing to the Barbie, to the Barbie movie for me because I'm gorgeous. And yeah, he looks better in her clothes than she does. I know, right, Naomi? Yeah, two-piece. Yeah, we, we already talked about that. She has a pink jacket. Yeah, I'm stealing her other jacket for that movie for her too, so yeah. Just eye eye socks. Open toed sandals with chunky high heels. And then they're admiring. It's like, geez, why do people think she wears black? Like, seriously, she does not look good in black. She's an us. Or Ainsley. Oh, yeah, I trust her. Is he around about rainbow accessories? So she has a sparkle shirt, a black belt, a short rainbow sequin strapless dress, shimmery socks, black heels with, 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 with clear straps, and a buckle skirt. So here's how it is described as bold. So yeah. Okay, now we have a part about accessorizing. Accessorizing how to's. And there's the page. Okay, let's rock by, by, by Daphne Minton, who he feels very underrated. There's a lot of gold in the Rainbow High accessory rainbow, but there are also quite a few silver linings and colorful gemstones, too. When adding accessories to your ensemble, that's fashion speak for outfit. Fashion needs to look for statement pieces, like the, the Devious Twins r &H earrings. Yeah, we slay! You two can shut up! Yeah, shut up! Featured. You're so mean. No, you're mean. Just yeah, just just shut up. Some of us are, are totally team gold, while others are all about the silver. Yet yeah, there's the pic there's the pages. Okay, and now with the music section, Rockin' Out at Rainbow High by, by, by Poppy Rowan. There's the pages. The music at R.H. is so fresh. I'm super psyched to write about the amazing, inspiring songs and musicians here. This year, some of us get to, got to work on a music video for the awesome student-run band, Rainbow Dream. Featuring upperclassmen Vanessa Tempo, Lyric Lucas, and Carmen Major. It was a dream come true to help these amazing artists turn their color up. As for me, my, my, my signature read style is pop with sick beats mixed with, 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 with EDM. I believe the right music can set the vibe for any situation. The editors asked me to share the freestyle rap I came up with. In class, I can... I can turn anything to a song. 
I like this guy. I like this style. Love the beating. It's so sweet. And I, I really have to smile. Skyler, you're my girl. It's only never guys, but you're asking my opinion. It's only giving me lies. <laughs> if I go and make a choice, I, I'll just tell you how I feel. I see. I say this one's a winner because I gotta keep it real. Yes, yeah, sorry, Adama. I don't, our Adama doesn't rap. Yeah, she doesn't. Her style, her sing style is more operatic. Yeah, it is. She can hit a high C even. Roomba High is so awesome. We even have her our own theme song. I dare you not along to sing along to the chorus. You were high. Okay, what? Oh, great. It's throwing your collar up. <laughs> of course it is. It's their yearbook. Okay. Okay, let's just read the lyrics then. Because we're not singing this. The thing is, we this, this disgraceful shadow high. Okay. From high, whatever your color, you got to look down his right, just like no other. You got the hook, so amplify it. Turn your color up, turn your color up. Go and say it, slay it, fast and frame it, rainbow high. But yeah, there's that section. <laughs> and then there's... <laughs> Oh wow, we're almost the end of this. So there's highs and lows of the year. Year in review spotlight, failures and successes, success, rainbow high on ice, cheer squad, radiant week, ruby on the cover of the scene, runway week, and fails when Poppy got stranded on thin ice during winter break. When Georgia lost her voice right before the winter play. When Jay created mood makeup and Amaya's face turned beat red. Major freak out when Amaya lost all clothes right before, right before the, the big runway show. So we only have two more pages to go, so let's do this. Okay, it's our agent sparkle on that page. So for awards, social butterfly poppy, most shell Vanessa, best matchmaker Kaya, or Kia, I think MVP Aiden, most humble Skylar, biggest prankster Ruby, most outspoken Karma, most versatile River, best actor Georgia. Well, the style Jade, biggest comeback Bella, most energetic Sunny, most likely to, to succeed Crystal, most comfortable Marissa. So there's a quiz like, how well do you do and do and do in your classmates? Which from high student was a competitive figure skater when they were younger? Jade. Which home is by the beach? Who's whose home is by the beach when they're not at Rainbow High? Poppy. Who spent the first few months of school at an internship traveling through Asia? Jet. Which student grew up in a castle? Stella. Who has a podcast about rocks and gems? Daphne. Which window loved to create major drama on stage and off? Technically, Laurel and Holly would be the, the answer for that one. Yeah, because we're the best. No, you're not. <laughs> Which RH design students does, spends their summers working for a family's company in Shanghai, China? Lily. Which RH ro rock star used to study classical cello at a, at a music conservatory? Karma. Ka I, mean, I mean, Carmen. Yeah. Carmen, not Karma. Their names are just too similar. And we don't go through school, so we can't tell them apart that much. <laughs> I 
who got kicked out for not following the rules. Bella. Yeah. Okay, that's... So that's the end. And then, we're on the last page. It says, we'll see you next year. R.H. And that's the end of the book. You know, mysterious audience, we hope you enjoyed this little, this super long story time with us because it's just, I don't want you to read this with us. And we hope you guys enjoy it as well. Well, goodbye, mysterious audience. We love you. And we really enjoy reading this story with you. Tune next time to see us unbox our, our triple gangers or doppelgangers, whichever ones our mommy just decides to unbox.